What's going on, guys? Welcome to my reaction to Gintama 284. We're continuing this arc of, well, it started out as a confessional, people telling their sins to Tama, and now it's kind of a whole different thing, because Gintoki's arrested, and the Shogun has amnesia, and is teamed up with Katsuro, so now it's a whole different direction that I'm very excited to see more of. I'm really glad it ended up being an arc. I didn't think it would be, so uh, let's go ahead and jump into it in three, two, one. What's happening? <laughs> There's a bunch of orange. It's like a weird Crunchyroll logo or something. Okay, Evening Edo. Thank you. Shogun is missing. I want to go back and see what those other news stories said. I saw something about fireworks. All the blame is put on you. That he would kidnap the Shogun? Although, I don't know if they're going to recognize him on sight. Right. He is he's in jail, I guess. May as well be what? I don't know what that is. I just have something in my fucking eye. <laughs> Where Where did the Shogun go? Katsura. You absolute. I was silent for a while because I was trying to process, like, wait a minute. Is it possible that Katsura doesn't even know that that's who that is? And I was like, no, it can't be. And then I'm sure enough. That's what's happening. He doesn't even fucking know. So he's actually... I thought he was being sarcastic. He was actually congratulating Gintoki. <laughs> he doesn't even know! I don't know if that's funnier. If we had a plot where he knew that was the Shogun and he was, like, trying to turn him into a true rebel. It, it might be even funnier if he doesn't fucking know... And the Shogun doesn't know who he is, and I guess everybody else will. I don't. We'll see how that goes. Makes Katsura a little more innocent in the whole thing, not knowing what the hell's going on. Being a leader is tough. Sure. <laughs> they probably don't. Okay. It's fair that not everybody knows exactly what he looks like, but Katsura, somebody who's like so deep into this and is like, ah, oh, the man I've been trying to overthrow for years. You should know what he looks like, that's for sure. That's just what happens when you find somebody and you can mold them into whatever you want to be. Hey, do you want to topple the nation with us? How do you know? How do you know he has what it takes? 
And that's why. It did nothing to do with being a Shogun. It's totally, totally random. Oh yeah, there you go. He's on the TV. I guess he's... Are you paying attention? Yeah. <laughs> why are you so stupid? And I can't help thinking that the Shogun's robe has, like, the Walmart logo on it. <laughs> That's just how it looks. How would you know? You're just making him that way? You're not allowed to call anybody leader except for Kagura. I'm glad they all realize. Of course he won't. S s suddenly it turned into a Katsura arc. It wasn't that at all, and then it turned into Katsura and the Shogun, which I couldn't be happier about, because that's great. Why? <laughs> if something suddenly turns into Katsura, great. And the Shogun, too? Hell yeah, I'll take it. Oh, that's why? That's why? Jenga. It's a great analogy for leadership. They're all gonna lose faith in their leader. You're gonna... Okay. You gotta dodge. You gotta be wary of your surroundings, and you gotta dodge a lot of shit while being focused as a leader. Why is that playing over and over again? <laughs> Just to be annoying. Alright, yeah. High stress situation where you gotta keep your cool. Probably gonna fuck up immediately. Okay. Yeah, they went after the organization. You gotta protect your people, not just yourself. And now you're getting hit. Okay. I guess he's blocking. Well, no, that's, that wasn't a block. That was his face. <laughs> you set that up. I'm not a fool. I'm Katsura. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Okay, go Shogun. Go get him. He's going to prove to be a, a born leader. He's not playing Jenga anymore, but he's, he's running with the metaphor. <laughs> okay, alright. How is he protecting that and... She should just target that part of it. She's targeting him. I guess to be fair. You don't need to be fair to Katsura. Wow. Oh. He caught it. It's like he caught the organization before it could fully collapse. How did this happen? How did they all end up on top of him? How did he set them up like that? I mean, I guess I guess he's just very talented. He's pulled it off very fast. It just didn't seem like he was doing that at all. And then suddenly he's underneath all the dominoes. He was just very fast. Yeah, they're all going to want to leave Katsura and go join. <laughs> Give up their position as rebels and go to the opposite side just to be with the better leader. Didn't you already destroy that? Okay.
Why? Why? Tiny whiteies. Why? What? Uh, why? He looks like an extra. <laughs> Is stubborn the biggest insult that Katsura could receive? Not really, really stupid. <laughs> Too serious. Farted the other day. <laughs> People fart. <laughs> what the fuck? How the hell did that happen? Is reversi the same thing as Othello? Because that looks like Othello, but I don't know if there's a difference. I like Othello. Oh, nice. So kind. So pure. Yeah, I noticed that. I noticed that some of the pieces looked like they were black on the bottom, too. I just wasn't sure if that was just animation or little art shortcut <laughs> but no that was actually the case my god he's so a beautiful <laughs> winner <laughs> he did lose in humanity you're right it's part of who he is oh no they're all gonna switch sides They're going to lose their ideals just because their leader is so bad. What game are we going to play next? Shoot some ladders. Can play poker. Anything. How does that TV keep getting repaired? How many times does he have to destroy it? He keeps bringing it back. <laughs> Uno. Okay, of course. <laughs> that was quick. That was his last card, too, so he uh, poured salt in the wound. Not only did he win, but he had to draw four more cards just to add insult to injury. Holy shit. He gained a bunch of new followers when he didn't even know who he was. That's impressive. Doesn't matter if you call him Zura or whatever name. He's always the Shogun. Oh my god. That's... <laughs> that was pretty good. I expected her to just be like getting ready to go with the Shogun, but being dressed like that, I didn't expect. That was funny. That didn't happen. So now we have to deal with Gintoki in jail. The Shogun's memory... This all started just because some people in the bar were coming to Tama for advice. How the hell did we go from that to this? I, I like it. I like this direction. It was very unexpected. It's just playing Uno. After he becomes the Shogun again, is he going to remember all this? And him and Katsura are going to be like weird friends? Maybe. You're losing respect. You already lost it. <laughs> okay, thank you. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Cruel. I don't know. What?
That's a hell of a prison cell. That's scary. There you go. Two birds with one stone. Unless he gets captured too. Oh, damn. He's actually here. He came to save him. Because <laughs> he's such a nice guy. Although he's knocking people out and they're not seeing that he's alive. <laughs> God damn it. The Shogun doing all of this. He's always a good source of comedy. Yeah. I don't know. He seems like he's happy. No, he doesn't. No. Y yes, how about that? Why don't you go ahead and become the nation's new ruler? That's enough of a compromise, I guess. <laughs> yes. I would hope. Kasura doesn't know what you're talking about, though. Oh, God damn it! you fucking asshole. Don't try to make him kill his sister. Don't you try to kill her either. She's like nine. Uh-huh. Gintoki, go get the sister and protect her, please, and resolve this. <laughs> They would never imagine who one of those intruders is. <laughs> they don't know what Chochan means. Nice! I bet you didn't actually deflect all those. Oh, he did? Whoa. I thought for sure he was going to get hit by some. He actually did it. Okay, alright. He got hit, though. He deflected them into him. <laughs> Maybe he'll get hit in the head and remember. Oh, nope, in the ass. Okay, he actually didn't get hit by the arrows. He just... I don't know how the fuck that happened. <laughs> and I don't know why it's always the ass with you, Sirachi. I guess just because. <laughs> it's always the ass. The ass blood is just not a fun thought. He wanted to give the Shogun a tail. Uh, oh god, why? You have to- oh, ow, he landed right on the dick. You gotta humiliate him as much as possible, of course. Poor man. A pervert! A hentai! And yeah, now he's just... A pervert. No. <laughs> His ass. It's just out in the open.
Really? When? When did they figure it out? So he remembered who he was and knew who they were, and Katsura figured out who he was. When? I want to know when that happened. But now they've become true friends. Or something. Maybe he never had amnesia at all. And it was all a strategy. Was Katsura really stupid the whole time, or did he actually only figure it out later? You know? He might have known the whole time. But okay, that's an interesting little relationship that got formed there. At least she's safe. You just right over there the whole time? What friend? Kagura? <laughs> she just sleeps over at the, the at the fucking Shogun's house sometimes. Cool. <laughs> yeah, like I said, there's only one leader. Oh my god, what the hell? Where the hell'd they all go? What the fuck? Where did they go? What just happened? <laughs> it's like the Kotatsu from before. Okay, I guess a leader can make shit like that happen. I told you she was the one true leader. Wow, okay. I thought this might even go on for another episode, but it was resolved a little more quickly because it turned out they actually knew who they uh, knew who they were, so it resolved pretty quickly. But uh, overall, it was a really fun idea for an arc, so I liked it. K uh, Katsura and the Shogun, pretty good pair, pretty weird. You fool! Yeah, that was a good one. That was a fun time. Eventually, the Shogun will have to be really serious again. Eventually. Uh, oh, Kentoki! Where'd he go? <laughs> Alright, so we finished off that arc. Love is a roach motel. The hell does that mean? What are you talking about? I want to go back at the beginning. Where was it? The, like the very, very beginning. I want to see those other news stories. Where, where was that? Let me find it real quick. Am I missing? Was it after the OP? I want to find. I want to find where those news stories were. God damn it! Whenever I'm looking for a specific moment, I can never. F okay, it was the very beginning. Serial couple assaults that only occur on the nights of fireworks displays. The serial couple assaults? So assaults on couples. It's not a couple doing the assaulting. Is Amarau Daisaku moving to a foreign club? I don't know what that is. I don't know who Amarau Daisaku is. The world sinks except the Kabuki district. Wins the golden raspberry. 
that's all I wanted to know. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.